What's up guys, I'm here for another video, and today we got some more Godzilla X Kong The New Empire looks. And, um, today it's Suko and Doug. Um, I don't know when these, uh, when this is gonna come out. I don't know if it's gonna come out in the January 1st release. I'm not too sure, but there is an in-hand picture of it. It's Doug and Suko, and honestly, the Suko figure looks a lot better than, you know, what... We saw, and that was because of the blurry images. Um, but yeah, the Suko figure doesn't really look too bad. I mean, I think, yeah, again, I think the Kong figures are looking really good so far. Also, I don't know if he's holding an egg, or I, I really don't know. We also have Doug here, so that's, um, that, that's something. Um, Doug doesn't look bad here either. Of course, we need to see more more photo photos of Doug, but it does look like he has some articulation. So, this is actually pretty exciting. Uh, like honestly, I, I would say this is pretty exciting. Um, to see, and um, yeah. So there's those two. So the top three we're gonna take a look at first is Suko, Wart Dog, and Shimu. Uh, for some reason, Suko is raising his hand, or, like, waving, I, I don't know what the hell this is and why, it looks cursed, uh, Wart Dog, you know, we, is, the, if you're wondering what this creature is, it's in the trailer when Kong is chasing them down, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be at the beginning of the movie, so, there's that creature, and then next we have Shimu, which, yeah, again, looks like a dog taking a shit. Next, we're going to take a look at War Kong with the Infinity Gauntlet and Evolve Godzilla. And uh, Doug looks normal. Uh, I like the Doug one. I think that, it, you know, uh, Kong with Fist, you know, it's just him with his Infinity Gauntlet. And then we have Evolve Godzilla, which I, I still don't like the stomach area. Yeah. Um, we have Kong... Raising up both his hands. We uh, we have Scar King, which is doing a Donkey Kong pose. And then we have a regular Godzilla. from Not evolved. So, I mean, yeah, there we go. There's those six. Next thing is these bag clips. And I know I did talk about these in my last video. But yeah, so our first four we're going to take a look at is the Kong with his... Uh, Infinity Gauntlet, which, you know, we have Shimu, and we also have Doug, so, you know, they're just bad clips, so they're not the most accurate things, but the one thing that's crazy about these is that we got a look at Mothra. Now, here's the, here's the thing about Mothra, is that in some of my previous videos, I talked about how Mothra replaced, uh, uh, Phosphira, and it seems like that is going to be true. It was said in some leaks to have, um, um, uh, apparently she has, uh, feathers on the wings, which I think you could see that at the end of the wings. If you look at the end of the wings, you can see, uh, the, the feathery, like, wings. Also, um, she's like glowing orange which yes mafia has glowing orange in previous films but she's like fully orange which basically is kind of the fire powers that she is supposed to have in this film which is really weird and different um i i don't know how they're going to do this mafia I, I i i really don't know but yeah that's mafia um there you go that was leaked and I, I'm pretty sure these are also in stores, too. So you can find them whenever they release the figures. So, yeah. And finally, we have Scar King, Evolve Godzilla, and Suko. And, you know, we already seen these guys in the trailer. The big thing out of these bad clips are the Mafra. So, yeah, let's get into the next thing. Uh, next thing we have is a picture of the Godzilla mask. Now, we already seen the Kong one. And now, and this is a new sculpt. It's not the Jack specific one. I thought they might reuse that one, uh, but they're not. They're making a new mask, and it does look like there's like zits breaking out on his face. And I know 
those are like to breathe for the mask and to see so yeah I, well no it's to see for the mask um but yeah there, there's godzilla and it looks all right it like i like the sculpt it's just the uh, the little holes that are kind of throwing me off with this mask um yeah but it's it's like an improvement from the jack specific sculpt it's just you know yeah again those those holes are kind of throwing me off now, here's the thing I also want to talk about, are these Godzilla X Kong toys showing up in Walmart now. Um, the official date is supposed to be January 1st. Um, I have not found them yet. Some people are getting them early. I have not found them yet, um, but it's supposed to be January 1st. So I will be checking my Walmarts on January 1st, of course. Um, I know there are scalpers already on eBay for lots of like there's lots of fig of those figures going on for like 80 to 100 bucks i just want to say something about that don't don't buy that they're ten dollar toys and and you know for the kong figures and stuff i think that is it is good for ten dollars and especially scar king I think the Scar King looks good for 10 bucks, especially with all that articulation it has. And then, you know, you have the Kongs and stuff. But they're $10 toys. Like, I, I could see you paying, like, $10 extra for them. But going out the way, way to pay, like, 30 bucks and, and higher is just... Don't do it. Um, just don't give in. Wait for the release date. And if it's not out that day, just wait. Just be patient. I know it's, it could be hard, but you just got to be patient with these things and they eventually, you eventually get them. So just, and be careful with what you're buying because they, I, I'm just going to be honest with you. They're not the best quality of figures and I never expected them to be the best quality of figures because they're $10 toys. They're for kids and that's how you should look at it and not go crazy about these because... Well, I'm not saying, like, you can't, like, be happy and excited for these because I'm really excited for these. I'm just saying just don't pay too much for these. That's all. And, yeah, I mean, and you know what? They're not bad. I would say they're not bad. The Evolve Godzilla is good for what it is, and same with the Shimu figure. But that doesn't mean they look a little off. So, for that being said, I hope you enjoyed this video. I want comment down below what your favorite figure is or what you like about these figures and you know what's your opinion on this video also i did create uh i did hand select some videos for you it's a series called kaijun friends me and my friends worked on it and it's honestly really funny and i really hope you enjoy it um and yeah that's it for this video i'll see you guys in the next video peace